the sine of the inverse cosine of u. Well, I can start off here by saying that the cosine of some random theta is equal to u. The inside's all I'm concerned about right now. And I'm going to write this out here. Um, so it's going to be in quadrant one. Uh, this is u is just some arbitrary value. So u here, and then since it's it's x the adjacent over the hypotenuse, we c it's simply just u over one. So I know that. So then we have the sine of this triangle. You're basically finding, going to find the sine of this triangle here. And this other side here, if you remember the Pythagorean theorem, that um, in this case, the hypotenuse uh, squared is equal to both sides squared. And in this case, we can substitute in for r, 1 squared, which is just 1. And we have for x, u squared. And, well, we don't know... Um, well, it's, it's still y squared, but we don't know what y squared is. The representation of it, though, will be y squared is equal to this um, uh, 1 uh, minus u squared, or simply y is equal to the square root of 1 minus u squared. And the sign, again, is y, where did you go? Uh, y over r, and in this case, that's simply going to be um, y, the rep representation of that's 1 minus u squared all over 1, or simply the square root of 1 minus u squared.